Blessed day, my people. So in today's video, we're going to talk about the police them holding a person of interest as it relates to the disappearance of Philip Paulwell, baby mother, and his 10-month-old child. You understand, my people? So them end up a take off somebody. You see me? Like them, they're going to leave the island and police go so boom, boom, and intercept and take the person off. So I'll give you some more information on that. Also, we're going to talk about female entertainer medic who is still missing. And this week, I'm going to make four weeks, which is basically a month since medic has been missing missing right and some people might think that this is like giving up hope as her mother is basically shutting down her business you understand because the mother can't afford for pay the rent the rent are like hundred and a thousand or so water about it also we're gonna talk about footer hype blaming popcorn and denik as watermelon drink has stopped selling or allegedly stopped selling in a particular supermarket also we're gonna talk about vibes cartel baby mother shouted this in the police wicked 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 after they came into her home saying that they might look for scammers so she make a post uh, address that right my people all so we're going to talk about Beanie Man, baby mother, Crystal Tomlinson, allegedly responding to D. Angel, who made some comments about her. Also, we're going to talk about Dalton Harris revealed that he's no longer into men after making a post saying that he's now looking for a girlfriend. Jamaican people, they might beat him bad. Also, we're going to talk about Bojo Bantan being bashed after supporting PNP for their 85th annual conference. And also, we're going to talk about dancehall artist King, baby mother, who is currently pregnant again. Yes, more people you don't know say him youth i think him son is about one year old now or one and some months or something like that so you know some people shock for sister share breed again right my people so those are the topics we're gonna talk about but before we go no further don't forget for like share and subscribe also head over to my instagram page mix up time four but i definitely appreciate that right my people so the first thing we're gonna talk about is shorty the baby mother of vibes cartel and a post where she make well couple posts where she make actually upon her instagram status right and of course you know say yesterday was was a hectic day for them as police went to their house and basically said that they might look for scammers and stuff like that, right, my people? So this morning we see Shati and make it be known, say, you know, the police, them just red eye, them just bad mind. You understand what I said? Not a thing no goes about them and look for scammers. And she also wanted to be known that when it comes to her kids, she don't play around. You understand my people? So basically, she made that post here saying, no joke when it comes down to my kids. And she posts that photo, you can see it. And she said, you can do all things but fail. You see it? And she also went on for make a couple of posts. You don't know she post up her three youths, them and thing. And she said, the P-U-S-S them red eye both them are look for scammer and she put a laughing emoji well crying laughing emoji you understand so she basically said that the police them red eye them now look for no scammer you understand me i said them just see the youths them i drive nice things and those things like say you know remember them daddy have money in the people you understand regardless of where them father they of course the music sells so the youths them are going profit or fight you understand me i say no i'm not here swearing for anybody because i don't know them personally but you don't know it just seem like a definitely targeted move in my personal opinion you understand or maybe a wicked neighbor you know call police and tell them say yo you know say some you know whatever it may be you can't ever trust the neighbors them at times so anything is possible somebody go down and do this for spite because i know the first time police are got the yard but that's our shorty officer she not play when it comes to our youth them is it so let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section so the next thing we're going to talk about is a person of interest who the police has held as it relates to philip Paulwell, baby mother and 10 month old child who has been missing for about our week now I think about a week and a day or something like that but let me actually get to this story so i understand what's going on you understand more people so this is what the article is saying person of interest in disappearance of paul wells daughter was on watch list a person of interest in the investigation into the disappearance of a woman and the infant child she shares with opposition member of parliament mp philip Paulwell was on an immigration watch list law enforcement sources have disclosed his identity was not disclosed as top level investigation is being conducted on a need to know basis sources said the sunday gleaner understand that the man was turned back by immigration authorities at the norman manley international airport in kingston after he showed up to board a flight on friday the person was on an immigration watch list he was on the way out and we stopped him from going a source revealed yesterday however the man is not in police custody according to multiple sources deputy commissioner of police fitz bailey declared 
declined to comment on the probe when contacted by the Sunday Gleaner yesterday. The investigation is ongoing, and I am not going to comment any further, said Bailey, who heads the police criminal investigation branch. It is believed that 10 month old Saraya Palwell and her mother, 27 year old Tashana Patterson, were taken away from their home on Gilmore Drive in St. Andrew on September the 9th. They were last seen at about 7 a.m. at the gate to their home, according to family members. One week later, their whereabouts remain a mystery despite a $500,000 reward for information that could lead to their safe return. Calls to Palwell mobile phone yesterday went unanswered, but in a Facebook post on Friday, the six-term MP for Kingston East and Port Royal described the past week as very horrific for me. He said, despite efforts, nothing has brought the police or family members closer to locating his daughter and her mother. I have dealt with many things in my life, but the disappearance of my youth and the mother is by far the most difficult thing I have ever had to navigate, said the former cabinet minister. So yes, my people, let us watch and see how this thing unfolds. You understand? Hopefully, the, the youth and the baby mother are still alive. You understand, my people? We just have to hope for the best cause. Remember, we talk about a week later and not a day later, is it? So let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So now we're going to talk about Beanie Man's baby mother, Crystal Tomlinson, seemingly responded to D-Angel after D-Angel said some stuff recently. Although D-Angel, to be honest, she never called her name, but based on what she said, a lot of persons are speculate that she was actually talking about Crystal. But let me get to this article so I want to understand a little bit more, right? So the article is saying, Crystal seemingly responds to D-Angel. While D-Angel did not name drop the person who prohibited her from performing with her ex-husband, Beanie Man, it is believed that she was referring to Crystal Tomlinson. Beanie Man's ex-girlfriend was painted as a jealous girlfriend during one of D-Angel's previous live streams. The spicy live stream featured D-Angel, legally named Michelle Downer, opening up about her work and money being affected by Crystal's stem objection to Beanie Man performing with his ex-wife, even though they share a child. After spilling the tea, D-Angel also gloated about the current estranged relationship that Crystal and Beanie Man have. This live stream has apparently caught Crystal attention and she responded to D-Angel with a lengthy message on her Instagram page on Saturday night. The message featured a happy picture of the former president of the People's National Party Youth Organization spoke about not caring about those who are offended by what she does and outgrowing things that will not hold her back. Crystal wrote, never mind who is intimidated, offended and losing sleep. Set your boundaries, stand your ground and honor your principles. They'll feel a way like Beyonce says, but give them space to feel their feelings and figure it out. Your power emerges when you hashtag outgrow the need to be like people whose values and principles don't align. Your power emerges when you outgrow the need to be understood by those who get eager food from misunderstanding you. The message continued by saying, your power emerges when you hashtag outgrow the belief that you're responsible for managing people's feeling. Your power emerges when you outgrow outgrow the fear or criticism, failure and loneliness, and trust God to work all things together for your good. And when you outgrow it, stay out. Don't give up your power by looking back. Lot's wife can tell you about the saltness of the look back. Outgrow and you can go. Yes, it so. That's how Crystal Tomlinson said, my people. And although none of the ladies them never call name, but you don't know social media will pick up things easily based on, you know, maybe certain things that was said at a particular time. You understand? But I don't know. I just go for where the article is saying, and also where the people them are saying on social media is it anyway let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section so the next thing we're going to talk about is medic my people and her mother has revealed that she will be closing down medic's business you understand my people now medic business it did a go on good you don't know the popularity as it relates to her business was growing but of course we see what happened to her now she cannot be found and thing now the mother is saying that based on like the rent hundred and i think hundred and eighty thousand dollars the mother said per month you don't know it ago hard for actually you know fuck up that you understand me and say my people so the mother make it be known say she has shut down the business and of course a lot of persons would be reacting to this news you understand me and say 
Um, like me say, my people, very sad news. And this week, I go make what? one month. Well, Thursday I come, it's going to make one month since them can't find medic. You understand what I mean? I say, no bit of information. The only thing I see are those little accusations. I say that the person they involved in it and re re. But as it comes to like the police, we don't see them or give out no information upon this. You understand? I'm just, I don't know. It just weird. It, to me, this case has, like I say, just not getting the treatment where it's supposed to get. You understand? But anyway, my people, I just want to know say, this is what's going on as it relates to medic mother. You understand? So do you think that this is basically her way of finalizing? And say, boy, it look like made it now come home, you know. You understand, my people? You see me? More and if you think that's the case right about now, because I know I see all the different, different stories on the internet and thing, but I don't know what in the comment section, is it? So the next thing we're going to talk about is Bojo Bantan, or as some people call him, Gargamel himself, going out there to support PNP. You understand, my people? So we see a post was made over by the Jamaica Star page saying that reggae legend Bojo Bantan arrives the national, the People's National Party 85th Annual Conference at the National Arena. Yes, it and the post kind of rubs some people the wrong way. Zane, based on the comments, them a lot of people feel like Sir Bojo was definitely a man where loved the, the PNP party. That's why I'm forward upon the internet and I burn out Andrew Holness and stuff like that. You understand? May I actually get into some of these comments and thing and thing, right? So one person say, I know there was something weird about you, you know, but wait, him not have a daughter we are labor, right? Somebody say, Bojo, come here little day. No, you are burn out the government slash politicians, then you are wrap your tail with them. Shake my head as if PNP different from JLP. Kiss me teeth. Another person say, wicked Bojo Bantan will come cause politicians every day and how them give you for this. Yes, I guess a person I want to know where they would do. Forget Buju for come, they come, you know, show support to them. Anyway, um, let me read about one more comment. Somebody said, No, I'm a PNP a long time. Ever about no government, yes, it. So when you see the comments, them, a lot of persons, you know, them disappointed for the Bojo Bantan out there show support for a man where a lash out against Andrew Wallness. Some people think that both parties are really the same. And when I say the same, obviously, are different leaders. But if one win, it not going to really change what's going on in the country, yes, it. So I don't know more people. But I don't know anything about this. Also, I just see something, um, I don't remember if a nationwide or something where say, if election were to come, right now, right, right now, them say a labor right with that did win. You understand? That I want me sip on this paper you know, my people. See, you know, me I said I want me sip on the paper. And when I go in at the comments, me see some people I say, of course, a straight labor right, they would have voted for them thing. They so I don't know my people. Me also say footer hype. <laughs> Make a post basically a big up Bujo Bantan. You understand him say, Yeah, big up Bujo Bantan. Never scared for do the right thing. Power up. Yes, it. So I don't know as I say. Um, I can watch and see. Let me know anything about this in the comment section, my people. And since we we'll talk about footer hype a little bit, my people, footer hype make a post basically showing him in at the supermarket and also that the supermarket stop sell melon drink. You understand, my people? And footer hype I blame Denik and Popcorn for this. Cause of course, you don't know the whole watermelon saga and stuff like that. But I play this video and then I actually, um, yeah, talk, talk my mind. Watch this. All right, people, I'm there at the supermarket, see? And I'm going to show you the popcorn and Denny cars. Watch out. Watch this. Look. Fruit juice, them. Fruit punch. Ray, ray, ray. No melon. No melon. The people them stop sell watermelon juice. See a popcorn and then eat. Look here. No watermelon. The supermarket stop care watermelon. See a then eat and popcorn. Yes. Worldwide drama. No more watermelon juice not existing at the supermarket. I tell you. All right, my people, so really and truly, it could be a case where the, the watermelon juice actually sell off. You understand, my people? I don't think the supermarket people, them, and the overseas footer hype, them, not in Jamaica, Zine, the people, them, around them supermarket, they, 
them not care about this popcorn and then eat watermelon business. You understand what I mean? I said, them people are not really small minded, you know. You understand? I'm sure some white person probably own a supermarket there who probably don't even know who named Denik. You understand? I don't follow up social media. So I feel like so the Jews sell off still. That's my personal opinion. It not have nothing to do with popcorn and Denik. But, you know, that's my personal opinion. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So the next thing we're going to talk about is dancehall artist King, who has revealed that his baby mother is pregnant again. Yes, my people. So you don't know, a photo was posted, I guess, by Skeng. I don't mean, know if I want Skeng fan page post it, but I hope I pink wall my seat, right? Anyway, they must show the belly and I show what go on and thing. I actually show you the clip you see my people and then you can tell me anything. Skeng baby mother pregnant again. These memories for, for ourselves Where our eyes are never closing Hearts are never broken yeah, so you don't know a lot of persons are react to it over from pink wall. You understand what I mean? I say, people are saying king of your money, so I know nothing. You understand what I mean? I say, my people, and you don't know a child is a blessing and thing. And them really right, king seem like a good father based on the photos them when we see him post and, you know, try to spend time with him youths and all of them things. They understand my people. What do you see him go, go buy a chain and he make sure same buy one for him youth as well. You see it? He have to secure everything for him youth, you know. He not just buy nothing for himself. Yes, yeah, but anyway, my people, let me know when you think about this. I think the youth about what one year old now, one and a little bit, a month. I don't know. I'm not reach two yet still. So, you know, some people would have probably said this kind of quick and thing, but it is what it is. Anyway, let me know anything about this in the comment section. So, the next thing we're going to talk about is Dalton Harris, who has made a post on his Instagram page, not Instagram, um, over Twitter, seeing my people. He make a post saying that he's now wanting a girlfriend. I want a girlfriend now, right, my people? Now, of course, you know, Dalton Harris is a person where a lot of the Jamaican people, them are the artists, them, just public figures, them not deal with him, none at all. Of course, you don't know why. Remember, back in the days, Bunty did a show support to him, post him, and when time the photo come out with Dalton, sit down in a man lap, you don't know, Bunty delete after the whole of the picture with Dalton Harris. I think footer hype do the same. So people just stop showing him the support and thing. But at that point in time, him never followed out and say him was whatever. Zin, him did eventually come out though and say him is, I think he's some pansexual, something like that. They, people may not really follow up them thing, you, know, you see. But anyway, you know, we see him post up photo with one youth over there, one white youth, and them are blase and all. You understand? But anyway, my people, now we see him forward and make a post over up on Twitter, say him a look for your girlfriend, and me tell you, say, the people, them, you know, things say people would have said, yes, seem like him a come out of the dark now and come in at the light, but people, them have said, no, you know, you seem like you want to come. You know, S H I T up the girl, them. You understand? So the people, them are beating body in the comment section. But where anything about the post of Dalton makes him know I look for a girlfriend, my people. You see it? So, ah, Dalton, people, them no want to see you none at all. Them just no want to hear you talk about girlfriend because, you know, them type of videos the way you post up with man and all them things there. Just not sit well with some of the Jamaican people, you see me. Of course, you have people out there where I show him support the same way, but. You know, most people I feel like them just ever want to see Dalton Harris with no woman because him done dibble, dibble dabble over this already. But anyway, my people, let me know anything about this in the comment section. And that's it for the video. You know. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, head over to my Instagram page, Mix Up Time 4. I'm out.